Welcome back to A Juggler's Tale. My name is Sea Champion, and last time we just broke our strings of fate. This chapter we're starting, so we'll see what happens from this point. The war around her was merciless. Ungrateful as she was, she still had no regrets. I would too. I want to know how her breaking her strings of fate caused the war in the first place. Mercenaries and bandits had depleted the land, corrupted the innocent, slaughtered every man. Nothing but corpses and spears, burnt, broken, shabby, nothing left alive, except for the stupid brat Abby. Oh really? Tell me how you truly feel. I want to really hear those feelings. Impetuous as ever, and it hasn't helped her at all. Let's try that again. I'll go a little higher this time. Crawl away in your rabbit hole, Abby. And then, Tonda enters stage left. He rages and fumes. Now no one's here to save you. Twice a man's size, five times his strength. To teach this brat a lesson, he'll go to any length. Whichever way she goes, the trap will still catch her. Brash little thing, thinking she's something special. Mm, not special. The world around her closes in. Stop fighting back. Let the end begin. No. Not anything special. But something against you, yes. Without a question. He comes to get you and won't hold back. The time to beg mercy is long since past. No chance to escape him, Abby. Okay. Come out and play. Don't be a bore. These damned strings. Uh, come on! Oh. Abby, stop! You coward! Face your destiny! 
What? What a pathetic attempt. What? Yeah, right, paddle on. You think you've won? I make the rules. I'm sure it's not over with you. Oh, look how peaceful the lake is. So calm. <laughs> yeah, how long? Ah, Abby thinks she's safe, floating like a leaf. But there's more to worry about than a barbarian thief. In the eye of the storm. Storm. The eye of the storm is deceptively calm. But then it unleashes the force of a bomb. Nature is a thug while looking so romantic. A peaceful little lake can rage like the Atlantic. A gaping cavern, a cavernous whirlpool. Boat and passenger, in comparison, minuscule. No chance, Abby. Seems you'd better head back. Face Tonda and hit the sack. Otherwise, you will certainly... Abby manages to sail the troubled waters. How can she bring a force of nature to falter? But alas, her fate remains the same. The bandits are in march. See her squirm, like a worm on the hook. We're finally going to be closing this book. A pathetic little girl. You damned worthless idiots. Away with you. And you. Do you still think she has a chance? This pathetic little creature? Yeah. She's outsmarted you every point from this point. No matter. My world has more than hurricanes and bandits. As you'll soon see. Go on, go on. We'll see how far you get. See these ruins? The stones lie as they fell, and over all of it lies an ill omen spell. An ancient people that also revolted. An ungrateful bunch, though they'd once been devoted. They wanted more, more, more. They wanted to win, win, win. And now there's nothing left of them but the stories they're in. Oh, yeah. A sword in a stone. Ancient as it is famous. <laughs> but is it good for anything more than diversion? I was going to say, hey, look, it's the dog we freed you earlier. I knew for him it was going to be a good thing. A charming reunion. It truly warms the heart. Too bad Tonda will tear you apart. Let's see about that. It's only a matter of time before Tonda catches you. Be so kind and don't drag it out. <laughs> How do you like that? Damn it! Come on! <laughs> like I said... One strike. Abby? Abby? How long is this going to go on? This isn't how you write a story. She 
keeps out smiling. If you were really a hero, you wouldn't keep hiding. What are you doing in there? I'm putting an end to the story. Without no. your No! Tonda! Without your strings, Tonda's nothing. What have you done? What have you done? You you regret this. Enough of this nonsense. Come out, you little brat! There you are. I guess running. Not so fast. Ah. Can't go straight, turn. Aren't you tired of hiding like this? See? Not just you can break the rules. Now I'm fed up. I'll show you. It's gonna be pretty sad when the little girl outsmarts you. Ha! Ha! Have you decided to become a lumberjack? That's not going to help you. Abby, come out! So will the tree Enough fall of over? this pathetic game. Yeah, tree fall over, I get onto the wall. No, 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 no! Well, I was wrong. But still, being a full string or two. Oh, you will regret this. Go away. Pulling a string or two will be at least a Get away from him, you! Go away! No, you little... You are so dead! 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 He'll get you, little girl! Now it's over! Ha 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 There's no place left to hide. There's no place left to hide. Tonda wants his revenge. Smash him in the rocks, God. Oh, you're about to feel... Ah! Oh, damn. No. Stay away. Don't. Don't you dare, you maggot. Don't you dare. No! There's another one over here. There's no way out! 
No matter which side, you are mine. Prepare to die. Congratulations. No. no! I refuse to believe this. Oh, don't you dare. Stay away from him. Ah! How dare you? You're a puppet. My puppet. This world. I make the rules here. I'll crush you! Come here! I'm your creator, your god. You brat! To hell with you! You are nothing! Do as I say! Die, will you? Die! Problem, if you're a god, then why ain't I dead? How can I out a little girl outsmart you? I'm just saying. <laughs> it's kind of funny. Uh, this is all it looks like I can do, so... Go away! Just... Go... Away! No! 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 Please come! Don't get me wrong, that was a great scene overall, but that seemed a little anticlimactic. Hopefully there's more. Because it said revolt, and that wasn't really a revolt. At least not the revolt I imagined, anyway. I figured, you know, the other characters free it up, and then there might actually have been a little bit of a tussle or something. Yeah. No one's... wonder what's going on. He's thanking me, I think? For getting those strings off? Huh? Well, let's see what... If we can get him out. No?
Let's free, let's free the bear. Hopefully we've got enough people for it. Oh, he's finally free now. And no more strings. Still seems like a friendly bear. Everyone, for some reason, seems free, which I did not free. The first person I freed was... That makes no sense. What's going on? That's it. I mean, for a game, it wasn't overly that bad, but the ending had a lot to desire. That was a very poor, put-together ending. So much was missing, and yet... But overall, not a bad game. Well, if you like this video, consider subscribing and hit that like button. I'll see you next time. Bye!